You may have heard of double-decker buses, but what about double-decker bridges? Join the morning commute along a new railroad bridge that crosses the Yangtze, China's longest river in Wuhu, East China. Hello again, I'm Shahboz. It's my second day of Yangtze River exploration. Today, I'm in Wuhu city of East China, Sanhui province. I heard a new Yangtze River bridge came to operation not long ago. And this is the third bridge over the Yangtze in this city. The new bridge has made travel between the two sides of the river much easier. The high-speed railway that runs along this double-deck railroad bridge connects the three provinces of Henan, Anhui and Zhejiang. It took five years to build and cost over 10 billion yuan. Hu Xiao works at a local bank and he has to commute across the bridge every day. Now it's about 7.30 and who is going to work? To find out more about the bridge, I'm going to join him in the morning commute. Mr. Hu, I want to ask you, how long does it take to get to work? From your home to your work? And how about before? So you have more time now, right? Mm, yes. This bridge is just magnificent. Very beautiful. The new bridge is about 1,200 meters long and its two main towers are 588 meters apart. Do you know any people who commute like you every day or do you have any colleagues that you work with? I'm now standing by the beautiful Yangtze River. It's also the third longest river in the world. And if we move a little bit, you can see behind me there is an old bridge. The distance between the old and the new about three kilometers. And I heard there are three bridges over the Yangtze River in Wuhu City today. The new bridge has eased the traffic pressure on the other two bridges and made travel much easier. The first modern bridge project over the Yangtze River was finished in 1957 in Wuhan city. Today there are over 100 bridges crossing the Yangtze and more bridges are in the pipeline. I have seen a number of bridges along Yangtze River when we were driving and also visiting different places. I must say from the first bridge in Wuhan city to the bridges in Wuhu and also in many other places, the bridges over Yangtze River have played an important role in China's trade transportation and also economic development. It's been an absolute pleasure to be here and tomorrow I'm leaving to Tongling. See you there.